हरे कृष्णा क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम अनुज अग्रवाल प्रभु वाई आर द इस्कॉन डिवर्ड इज प्रोनाउंसिएशन ऑफ मेनी संस्कृत वर्ड्स डिफरेंट फ्रॉम द ट्रेडिशनल प्रोनाउंसिएशन फॉर एग्जाम्पल इंस्टेड ऑफ द नेसिल नृसिम्ह वी यूज नरसिम्ह इन इस्कॉन एंड सिमिलर देर आदर वर्ड्स ऑल्सो विच आर प्रोनाउंस डिफरेंटली देर इज यज्ञ एंड देर इज यज्ञ so uh, which are the correct which is the correct pronunciation and why are there differences in pronunciation like this answer pronunciation is not always something that is prescriptive frequently it is also descriptive in general in the study of language there are these two aspects there is prescriptive that means this is how it should be done and then there is descriptive this is how it is done and language is not something which is a frozen code language is a living reality and that's why quite often the descriptive uh, comes over to the prescriptive so for example in english you know the oh, some words are there which are used in conversation for example who done it now who done it is a shorthand for who has done it and it is used especially in mystery novels now who done it was a way which people spoke and gradually it came into english so it is now become a part of the way english is so so just as there can be words which can move from descriptive to prescriptive so similarly pronunciation can also move from descriptive to prescriptive so, so there are words like schedule and schedule they are pronounced differently and in different parts of the world both are accepted so the important point is that yes the nasal sound of nrsimha was what was the way the word was pronounced traditionally but for a significant amount of time and not just within the krishna consciousness movement but in other circles also nrsimha is also an acceptable form of pronunciation so in general we don't have to make a big big issue about pronunciations of course in some cases some pronunciations are Uh, grammatically wrong and they are also not acceptable colloquially so then that times we have to definitely correct but where there are uh, this forms of pronunciation which are going on for a significant amount of time we don't have to make it a uh, issue to campaign about if we feel more comfortable pronouncing it uh, with the nasal rsimha that is fine uh, but we don't have to campaign against those who use narsimha as a pronunciation thank you hare krishna